The demolition of the Babri Mosque in Ayodhya on December 6, 1992 was not planned. That is what a judge has ruled today, acquitting all 32 accused, including the BJP leader LK Advani, Murli Manohar Joshi, Uma Bharti of conspiracy charges in the landmark verdict. The judge said, and I quote, now that the accused tried to stop the demolition. This has come from the special C, uh, CBI judge S.K. Yadav. The judge also said that the Hindu activists who tore down the 16th century mosque were anti-social elements. L.K. Advani, who is 92, Murli Manohar Joshi, 87, Uma Bharti, above 60, they were not present in court but joined uh, through video link in the verdict as well. They had been accused of criminal conspiracy, promoting enmity and inciting activists with speeches from the dais next to the site. I've picked out the top five quotes now from the verdict for you. That includes uh, what the judge said. The, he went on to say that the Babri Mosque demolition was not pre-planned. Also added that not enough evidence against any of the accused at this point can't prove authenticity of audio or video provided by the CBI. Anti-social elements tried to demolish the structure. Accused leaders tried to stop them and also said that the audio of the speech is not very clear. Not enough evidence in all. To convict these people. In fact, like I pointed out, what exactly, uh, in fact, that is what the judge in UP in Lucknow had said. Now let's tell you what the Supreme Court has said on Babri demolition so far. The destruction of mosque uh, is a violation of rule of law. Muslims uh, disposed upon discrimination of uh, mosque as well. Also, uh, they said that uh, all this has been sourced to the Ayodhya verdict. Uh, in November 2019. Remember, this is the first leg of the verdict. It has come from a lower court, in fact, in this in this case, and this case could be going to higher courts as well. So lots of reactions coming in to that story as well. The first response from LK Advani. Well, he came out with a reaction as well. Let me lead out uh, some of the key points from there as well. He said that he had chanted Jai Shri Ram after the verdict, describing it a moment of happiness for all of us. The judgment vindicates my personal and BJP's belief and commitment towards the Ram Janmabhoomi movement. I also feel blessed that this judgment has come in the footsteps of another landmark verdict of the Supreme Court given in November 2019, which paved the way for my long cherished dream of seeing a grand Ram Mandir at Ayodhya, the foundation link ceremony of which was held on August 5th. All this has come out in a statement by El Advani, which added that wholeheartedly welcome the significant judgment along with millions of my countrymen. I now look forward to the completion of the beautiful Ram Dambal and Mandir in Ayodhya. In fact, my colleague Alok Pandey, who's been reporting on the story ever since, spoke with the Manish Mishra. He's the lawyer who represented some of the now acquitted people. Listen in. Sir, can you just tell us in brief how long did the judge take to give out the judgment and what were the main points? Actually, when the judge arrived after about one hour back and the uh, judgment that has been delivered by the judge, it took hardly 15 to 20 minutes. Mm -hmm. And the point that has been raised by the court was that three, three, four material evidence that had been submitted before, that had been be given before us, was that the video cassette that had been uh, submitted by the CBI were tampered. Therefore, that cannot be taken as a material evidence. Second of all, the paper cuttings that were produced by CBI, that paper cuttings cannot be realized because the authenticity of the the paper cutting has not been given by the CBI. And third of all, whatever uh, the Sasho Singhal, who was present on the spot, have uh, time and again stopped those car savers from demolishing that you know, from demolishing that mosque. So this shows that this was not a conspiracy by these persons who are uh, accused in this case. It was given by some anti-social elements. Can I just ask you, sir, the judge used the same video evidence to say that it was not reliable right. and the same evidence to say that Ashok Singhal tried to stop the people. Meaning thereby, Ashok Singhal, meaning that the cassette that had been produced by the court, mm -hmm. that was tampered in the sense because in that video cassette, there were a number of advertisements, number of samachas, mm -hmm. which had no relevance with this Babri Majid. Mm -hmm. However, when video footage was seen, in which, because that was the material evidence that has been produced by CBI, mm -hmm. 
बिफोर द कोर्ट दैट क्लिक विच इन विच अशोक सिंगल वॉज स्टॉपिंग कार सेवक दैट हैज बिन टेकन ऑन रिकॉर्ड की अशोक सिंगल वॉज सेइंग दिस इज स्टॉपिंग द कार सेवक नहीं प्रिंसिपल कॉर्डिफी द जज वॉज सेट दैट दीज ऑल दिस पर्सन हुआ इन्वॉल्व इन दिस केस हैव नॉट बिकॉज दे वर इन वे दिस वे और दर दे वर नॉट इन्वॉल्व इन केस ऑफ डिमोलिशिंग दिस केस मनीष मिश्रा वन ऑफ द Uh, people who represented the defense or the accused in the case the now convicted people in the case for 10 years uh, just told us about what all the judge said while delivering his order it took him around 30 minutes is what this gentleman said with rajesh gupta this is alok pandey ndtv